Hey there, everybody, and welcome back to Mind Over Magic at the Ember Tide Academy. And you'll probably notice things look a little bit different because I made an oopsie. So I made a recording. I was like, okay, let's go ahead and change, you know, go ahead and do the editing and everything. And I noticed my voice was gone. Well, I missed some of the OBS settings because I was trying to get stream settings working for YouTube and uh, Twitch. And so I decided to make a different profile for my recording versus what is actually going on on my streaming so that I can differentiate my streaming and recording. To put it short and simple, I had to reset all my settings and I thought I got all my settings except for my audio tracks. So the audio tracks were still not working properly. It only recorded the game audio and not my voice. And yeah, so that's where we're at now. So a couple of different things. There was an update for Mind Over Magic. Uh, they did a art and QL update. There is a new Vivified skin. So if you don't know who the Vivifieds are, they are our lovely puppet, uh, lovely zombie puppets over here. They're like the quilted carriers, except more advanced. And then they also had changed the way the conservatories look. So you can actually, if you look at the room here, you can choose whatever color you want for the conservatory. It makes it nice and not boring like it was before. You have music notes flying around. It is a very nice looking room. And then they also made some adjustments to QOL. You can now multi-select by doing a drag select. So you can say, like, hey, and then do all of the different options here. And they have, you know, uh, different keys for what you can uh, select on what you want to do. So if you just want to hunt, you hit O. If you want to harvest, you hit H. If you want to chop, you hit C, so on and so forth. So that is some nice QOL they did. They also did some gameplay changes. Uh, grounded also now counts for underground. So if you look at like the rooms list here, you can see that underground and grounded uh, are the same thing. So that you can actually put classrooms under here, which makes me think that we'll eventually maybe be able to expand our school to the underground, which would be nice. I haven't tested out to see whether or not we can put a room down here and it changes. Or, you know, for example, if we put like, I don't know, we put a classroom right here and this is like the earth classroom. I have no idea how that's gonna work. So like, you know, for example, if you get teaching, you know, the earth teaching slabs, this is a big room. It is a very big room. And the under school, like it, it can cover it sort of, but not probably to the extent that we need it. And it's very tall too. So I'm, I'm, I'm trying to figure out a use case for the grounded room and, um, in the school, but yeah, we'll, we'll we'll figure that out as we go. Um, but they also made some other gameplay changes, uh, some good digital quality of life, so on and so forth. You, if you guys want to, you can go over to the Steam page and check it out. The Steam page link is down below if you want quick access to the game and see what they've done, but you can find it on their community updates and on their most recent updates on the Steam page if you want to look more in depth there. Now then, I did take some of your suggestions and feedback into consideration. Uh, there's a crow corpse that we're trying to get rid of, so we're not we're having crow corpses that are running around. Our bird hatch, I really hate the fact that I missed this out for you guys. Um, I, I wish that you guys could have seen this. It was originally going to be my thumbnail for this video. But yes, this is hatched. Uh, we're now working on the chrome bug down there. And we have our people that hatched it for us. So that is very good there. Do we need multiple of them? Probably not. Uh, so that's what we're doing uh, with him. We did start working on our professor's uh, private quarters over here. So we have all of this over here. And we're working on two more of these buildings up here, which will be done eventually. And then we also have our mages study here. We had to make some adjustments to make it private again uh, because the conservatory kind of messed things up with that. And we're eventually going to turn this into a tower. We'll make this a double wall right here and tower this off eventually to upgrade the mage's study once we are able to make the scrivenry desk. And that will be require us to get some of the ash parchment, we are, which we are making now. But we also need to make sure we have smoke stick as well. And we've added some new things to our woodcuttery down here. We moved some, moved some things around. We are making this, a, we're trying to make this a more efficient place to make things happen. I'm actually going to move this guy back to kind of make this more even. Uh, because of the way I built this woodcuttery, things are not very even, obviously. Um, but we are working on getting that done. So that is kind of what happened. We also have the, um, we're making our atelier over here so that it looks a lot better. Um, uh, and then we also get the bonuses from it. It doesn't need to be separate, but I think before it was like an isolated room. And I think isolated was just completely separate from the school. I could be wrong, but it was, it did have that condition and maybe they took it off because they couldn't do isolated yet. Um, and that may be what requires teleporters. I know one of you mentioned in the comments below, but that is what's been done here. So that kind of covers everything that happened within the last episode. Um, I'm going to play for a little bit. Uh, it, 
with this one, this one may be a shorter episode just because I already did kind of a recording and then I'm having to re-record just based off that. So we'll kind of do some small things here and there, kind of clean up what I was trying to do in the previous episode, and we will move on from there. So someone is about to break. Who is breaking? What's wrong with you? Okay, we're not breaking anymore. That's good. A battle staff shattered, perform worse than battle. Horticultural results in a battle awaits. Alrighty, so my plans were to at least... Oh, I'm actually going to get rid of this guy. Because uh, I was playing with the idea of having a multi-level woodcutter here. But I think I'm going to hold off on that. Because it did not work the way I intended it to. Uh, which was unfortunate. But it's okay. And what we could actually do is we could probably like redo our woodcuttery and make the room more even. Because um, obviously it is not very even in the slightest. Um, it's qu quite off. But that's okay. We'll work with it. But the main goal is to get the Chromebug hatched, uh, which means we need these two students to finish their training, which they should be getting close to, I would think. So if you look at their magic... Oh, wait, you're nowhere near where you need to be. Oh, wait, have they not been learning? Oh, no. Have I not had a stone? Well, no, Grand Stuff should have been teaching them. Interesting. Is Grand Stuff not teaching? Because they haven't been learning at all, which is not good. Okay, well, let's go ahead and look at our task priority for Grandstone schedule. Uh, nope, not normal one. Priority. Uh, Grand Staff. Oh, he just prioritizes everything else above his teaching. Uh, so we'll have that. Um, whoops. So yeah, he should be teaching on his teaching. So I guess he just hasn't been teaching them, which is why they haven't been learning. Which really kind of sucks. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate. But we can graduate these other students. Uh, we don't need them at the moment. Uh, the one that we do need is going to be our Earth one, so Isabel. But Lytle, Marigold, and Farah, they can actually uh, they can actually graduate because we do have the bird hatched, which we needed the air and fire ones for. So we are good on that end. So once everyone wakes up, we can do that. And honestly, I think it's about time for people to wake up. Um, I'm going to fast forward a little bit. And then we'll get that. And then we need some uh, roof decorations and everything of that nature for this. Uh, we did research some lofty beds for our professors so that we can go ahead and start working on their uh, private rooms. And then uh, we are researching... What are we researching right now? We're researching rugs and tanning rack for the atelier down below so that we can complete that room. I think that just about covers everything that I did in the previous episode. Once again, I do apologize that I did not have a recording of it. Um, it's just one of those really unfortunate things that I tried to do something fancy to help save me some time, and I ended up hurting myself in the process. It's just one of those unfortunate things. Uh, but anyway, lots to do, lots to look at. Like I said, this is going to be a little bit of a shorter episode, but I wanted to get something out for you guys anyway. And once again, I do apologize that... Uh, that I did miss it. Um, I do, I do, I do really enjoy this game. I really, like I said, I, I, I feel bad. I do, um, but that's just kind of one of the things about being a content creator. I guess is learning uh, what what happens and you know how things work. And yep. All right, so Grand Staff is teaching now, which is good. Uh, we are missing a student who is not learning, but we do have that going for us, which is good. Uh, we need to set up individual classrooms eventually, but we'll get to that. This is an intermediate classroom, so it works just fine for the moment. Uh, we could theoretically, I think, let me check. We could make it an advanced one, if I'm thinking correctly. Advanced classroom, we need two or more bookshelves, which we do have, we can do. And we need a chalkboard. Oh, we need the specif uh, specific skill teaching station as well. Um, so we... Can we do that? Hang on, wait. I want to see something. I just want to look. Uh, teaching. Uh, let's go ahead and see that guy. That guy is just high enough. So we could literally put one... Yeah, okay, that's what we need to do. So it's an earth teaching stone, but we can go ahead and put this here. Um... No one's going to learn from it, but we can at least make this an advanced classroom. So let's move this. Actually, all of our students are, have learned from this one. So let's just go ahead and shrink it. We may need it later. And then I want to go ahead and put in this Earth Teaching Slab. 
Um, it's going to take up a lot of room. So we're going to put that in the very back here. We'll do that. And then we'll move this one to there. So we space those out properly. And that should... We need another bookshelf. Uh, so let's go... We need a chalkboard too. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so we have luxury. I need that to move. Please, close. Yep, there we go. Uh, we need a chalkboard, so let's move this out of the way. Also, if I if I pause, like if I just stop talking for a second, I do apologize. I'm having I don't know what's going on, but I'm having some terrible indigestion per usual. And uh, if yeah, if I if I stop talking, that's just because I'm kind of dealing with that at the moment. Actually, I want to shrink that instead. Uh, so they shrunk that. And let's see if we can put that chalkboard up. Uh, blocked by teaching slabs. Uh, okay, we can put that. We're just trying to get things in here just to make this room more efficient so the students learn faster. So we'll put a chalkboard there. And then we need one more bookshelf. And we can put that guy right there next to the teaching slab. That looks good to me. All right, it's a little cramped. Just a, just a tad bit. Actually, hang on, wait. Cancel that. Uh, build copy. Let's put that here. Ooh, nope, that's a candelabra. I want to build copy. Uh, that is in the way of the. We could put that in that corner right there. Actually, that wouldn't look too bad. Is that is that right? Yeah, it looks good right there. So we'll put that there. We have two bookshelves there, and that looks good. Also, I need to go for a moment, so I will skip ahead and be back with you guys in a second. Okay, guys, sorry about that. We are having to get some housework done, so I had to make sure I confirmed any appointments there. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and finish up this room. And hopefully we'll have a nice advanced classroom for our teachers to use. And this actually, I think, teaches more students as well. So there's really no reason for us not to use it. Um, actually, wait a minute. Is this not a teaching station? Teaches Earth can be used to create an advanced classroom or a Geomancer's Hall. Am I crazy? Isn't there some assignments to go here? How does this guy work? Because we have the access. Oh, I guess there's no access on these. I guess it just is used by whoever. Oh, it's not done being built. Ah, yeah, there's two. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah, I knew that. Oh, we got this guy too. All right, hang on. We got a battle. Ooh, that means scrolls for us. All right. Uh, let's just go and begin battle. I know it's y'all's free time, but, you know, you know, scrolls. And that way, we can actually maybe have enough to get our kitchen finished, which I'm excited about. All right, so let's go ahead and battle this guy, uh, Earth Armor. Uh, we'll do that. And I do apologize. I may have to uh, <laughs> skip in the recording again at some point just to uh, handle our um, uh, the maintenance work that's coming to help us with something on the house. So there's another skip. That is why. Okay, that was a easy victory. We have two arcane scrolls, which I think might be enough if we look at the spices. No, I think we need eight. Yeah, we need eight, don't we? Let's see, where is it? Uh, yeah, we need one more. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, that's fine. Alrighty, so you're working on that research. Uh, we are working on getting this classroom finished. Uh, it is taking some time to build, but that is okay. All right, I'm excited to see if there's any... Oh, you cannot finish that. You're a man, I understand. All right. All right, so we have all these smoke sticks. We have that growing. We have our ash parchment and stuff being worked on. Uh, we have plenty of things to be done up here, but it seems like students are doing other jobs besides taking care of the beasts. And it is quite far away, too, so that is something to worry about. All right, the fog is getting closer. Um... I don't have these paused either, so let's see. Access all students, tasks. Um, okay, so yeah, it does seem like the tasks is available. It's just, it's nap time, so they're all gonna go to sleep. <laughs> oh, but is, okay, this is still intermediate. All right, what's wrong with it? What is wrong, why are we not advanced? Okay, so we have skill specific station. Okay, we do have that. Oh, must not have. Ah, okay. So let's go ahead and, I guess, shrink that one too because we don't need it. Uh, so we'll shrink that. 
and then we'll move things around. All right, so we can't have that. So it has to have this skill specific one, which I mean, we might as well make another. Uh, we have the room for it. We might as well make another teaching hall. I don't see why not. Uh, we can literally use this room down here as one. We can use it as maybe the well, no, we're going to probably have to have a larger room. I have to check that. Um, but instead of shrinking this, we can just cancel that and move it. So we can say it goes. We can say it goes here. That could be our teaching area. And to make it an intermediate classroom, uh, we literally just need to put a bookshelf in it and it should be good. Yeah, we can literally do that and it works just fine. So what we'll do is we will put more candelabras in here. I'll put one in the back. Uh, we'll put them like that. Um, I like how this classroom also has no door. But it's fine. Um, we're just doing what we can at the moment. Uh, so let's go ahead and make sure we have a bookshelf as well. So furniture. We're out of smoke stick. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, we still need the two bookshelves in here, though. So we will work with it, what we've got at the moment. All right, so everyone's asleep, so I will skip ahead and see you guys when it is daytime. Okay, guys, it is daytime. They are dancing the night away, or not the die away, and I see my cat is behind my monitors again. Hey, Minna, how are you doing? Why do you always do this to me? <laughs> All right, so is this lofted? It is lofted. Okay, elevated, lofted, private. So actually, I could have made these rooms shorter because I noticed these are actually shorter than these. This is actually towered, too. Huh. Interesting, I guess because there's no room right there. Um, so I could have shortened these up, but we're not going to worry about that at the moment. I could have swore I made these the same height. Did I not? Hang on, let's, let's just do some let's do some measurements. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, they are the same height. No, they're not. But am I playing tricks on me? There's no way. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then the roof on top. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, the roof. Oh, the roofs are slightly different. Ah, that does it. Okay, so the, the walls are technically the same height, but the roofs are what's missing around with us. Okay. All right, so now we have an advanced classroom. Very good. And they are actually learning away, which is good. I can't see it move. Look at that. Yeah, that's kind of cool. All right, let's, let's move this guy because it's kind of... It's the students are in the the yeah they're they're not in a good spot so let's move that out around and then we can actually move this and uh by, block by earth teaching slabs uh that's fine we'll move that if we need to uh so who's teaching Drake Featherwing is teaching uh actually we want how's Drake doing in his teaching okay Drake is fine we'll we'll have that there um uh, actually oh, okay now I'm moving this again because I don't like that there uh we're gonna move it there. And then maybe the chalkboard can go behind it. Actually, it doesn't really make no sense, does it? We'll put the chalkboard there. All right. That's better. All right. That'll make me feel much better in the end. Yeah, I know. I'm changing this room up. Oh, we could have moved the other one. So now we have our basic classroom here because we don't have the bookshelf, uh, which we might be able to get now. Yeah, so we can put another bookshelf here. Do we need this? Probably not, but it's a room. It, you know, it's a, it's a nice looking room. All right, so there's a 200% learning right now comparatively to what we had before. So that is really good. Earth class begins. Everyone technically takes part of this. Um, if I look at access, all students, all staff. So yeah, everyone technically is taking part of this. Hopefully, okay, are you learning? No, you, oh, wait, why are you guys? Okay, no, 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 none. No, 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 no. Yeah, all students can learn here, but you guys go learn at the Earth class or don't. Why, why Why? are you not going to go learn up here? How many students can be here? Uh, none. None. Oh, are they not going to go learn? Claimed by grand staff. Maybe it's because the class already started. They're not going to go learn. I'll have to play with that and see if they actually go to this classroom. Because it seems like there's enough for students to be here. Um, yeah, so it seems like there should be enough space for all students to go there. So I'm not sure if that... We'll have to see next class if they learn there or not. If they don't, then I'm going to have to adjust that. Okay, so you need more smoke stick because your refining is not refining at all. Actually, 
I don't think a single student is working with you. I wonder why. Why pause and then unpause? Refining process due empty feeding need in schoolroom. Refining pause due to empty feeding need. Feeding needs to be fed slop. Oh. Okay, how do we make slop? All right, then this is something new. Slop, a meal for refining beasts. Even vivified characters won't eat it. Sources, gruel pot. Oh, we don't have slop. Okay, well, that's something new to us. Uh, I'm assuming that's in a research, so let's type in slop. Slop. Yep, spice things up. There it is, slop. Yep, so we really need that. So let's go ahead and do one battle down below here. Let's get that done. We can go clear out this fungal cavern real quick. Not a big deal whatsoever. So they're going to prepare to explore. We'll have that done. And then I'm hoping these two will learn fast enough. They pro Ooh, actually, they're learning really quick now that we have that done. That is great. All right, so hopefully there's no one stuck in a loop. No one's stuck in a loop. All right, that's good. All right, so let's go and get this done. We'll do Earth Armor on you so we don't lose our health bonus. Uh, Flame Lash, we're going to go ahead and utterly decimate one of them. It takes a lot of mana, but that's fine. And then we want to use... Just torrent, torrent's fine, because that that's actually costs less, but deals more. Granted, the other one does have some debuffs, I believe, that comes with it, so there is that. So I have Vine Lash. Um, we don't really need this, because we can go and hit. I'm going to put the Vine on you. And I noticed in the, I did, uh, in their roadmap, they did talk about expanding the combat, which is kind of one of my... Um, Kind of one of my negatives about the game is that the combat is not very fleshed out, in my opinion. Um, so I'm glad to see that they are going to address that at some point. This is an early access game, we have to keep that in mind. And I, for, for an early access game, it it is the core is there and it feels good, so. Alright, let's see here. Smash, I'm gonna hit you. And I doubt we're gonna get a crit on this, but it'd be great if we did. Nope, that's fine. And then we'll use Torrent to finish that up. Get our arcane scrolls. And then finally, have the stuff for our kitchen. Okay, we have some arcane scrolls, ectoplasm, and spore shrooms. So we'll let uh, the research finish here. And then once we do that, uh, oh, let's see how, is that gonna finish? No, I don't think so. We also need to look at what the requirements are for wand shaping tier three wands when we get to them. We don't have any of them researched at the moment, but. Also, the research is taking a while. How big is this research? A whole lot of support. Magic support. Yeah, there's the floating support thing. That's kind of cool. We need sculpt stone for it, though. Oh, that's a 4,000 research. No wonder that's taking a while. Okay, that's that's understandable. I can't give you too much grief there. Okay, so once that's done, we'll get that uh, researched. Uh, let's take a look at our... Yep, so we need... We have plenty of worm wheat and viscera, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do a major push here and not worry about this anymore. I'm going to take... I'm not going to take Jackson and leave him alone. Put Lila there. That's good. Okay, what is next? Okay, so they're all asleep now, so we're gonna fast forward through the night and make sure that that's all done. They're gonna repel the fog, so we don't have to worry about that at all. I think our school's starting to look pretty good. We're gonna have this massive, elevated, weird tower thing going on here, but that's okay. What I could do is probably have some of those special, like, floating ones. Except right there, that one honestly looks connected at that point. The weird things you have to do to make rooms look like rooms. I'm glad we were able to get advanced classroom though. This helps our teaching quite a bit. Um, can I move this behind here? No, I can't. Oh, that's unfortunate. I wish I could have it behind there, but oh well. Could honestly, could I move this? No, I can't. Okay, not enough room there. That's fine. We'll leave it as it is. I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Okay, well, as we go through the night, I will go ahead and come back to you guys when it is morning. All right, guys, it is morning. I was over on the other side of the map trying to collect some rune wood. Everyone is getting back to work. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and get this rune root on this side too, so C for chop. And then they'll chop that when it's available. Okay, cool. So we have the runewood going. Uh, we have some rats moving around. I think we destroyed that croa that was there, yeah, because I finally decided, you know, we're going to get rid of them. Uh, we have plenty of dire rats right here, so it's hunt. So, nope, not hunt. It's O, o for hunt. O for hunt. Okay, there we go. That was H. Okay, so what are we working on now? Uh, we, don't, we don't have any research yet. We have idle staff. Who is idle? Oh, Felicity's idle. Okay, interesting. Mana Drain, Marigold Complete, Solo. All right, cool. That's done for her. Let's see, how are your medallions going? Uh, eat in a room with no other students or staff present. Really? Now I'll make your water go up? You level up, so you're technically not done teaching. Oh, you're a five now in air, aren't you? Well, no, why are you... Not available to... Oh, because your water went up, so you still have to... F oh, okay. Also, I noticed these changed again. They were, like, blue before, but now they're kind of just golden. Interesting, I guess they changed that. I didn't read that in the notes. Oh, you need to clean three messes, but that's really, honestly, not going to happen. Um, let's see, so you have your creature comfort. Okay, so we really need to get the gruel so that, like, we can have more of these bees taken care of. Okay, uh, research is almost done. That is taking a while. We really need to think about getting the other tower. But in order to do that, we need the Scrivener's Desk, and for that we need Ash Parchment and Smoke Sticks. Which we do have a good bit of Smoke Stick planners down in here. Um, honestly, my wood cuttery is pretty awful in terms of organization. Um, I really should have made it better, but it's okay. I like how... it's so, Look how happy that is. So happy. All right. Yeah, I would love a refining beast room. I think that'd be awesome if we could have a dedicated, you know, like hut or something dedicated to the beasts. Okay, what I'm noticing here is that these guys these guys aren't learning. They're it, it's it's class time, right? So if we look at schedule, it is class time and only two people are learning right now. So I'm unsure of why that is, and it's only Lytle and Isabel. So I'm unsure of why that's happening and why the others aren't learning at all. And I, I wonder if it's because it's the Earth Stone and if you have to have Earth skill for it. So let's take a look. Let's see if I'm confirming that. So your Earth Wand, Fire Wand, but you and you don't have Earth skill. So you're that's weird. OK, hang on. You don't have any level ups in either. You're in fact, you're even maxed out. What? What shenanigans are going on in here? Access none, none. Okay, let's say that. All right, no teacher, all students, all staff. I wonder is it because they're not a certain level. All right, hang on. Let's just say all staff, all students, and they'll learn if they need to. I'm very curious if this is what's going to happen. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll just kind of put all, all and see what happens there. It's really weird, but not everyone's going to this Earth Teaching Slabs. Teaches Earth could be... Oh, what, is it only teaches Earth? Maybe it only teaches Earth. Yeah. Oh, well. We'll have to figure that out. All right, let's go ahead and get our... Where is it? Where is it? I know it's here. Where are you? There you go. Spice things up. We want that. And that, should, that one should take actually no time at all uh, to get done, which would be amazing if we could. So if this only teaches Earth... We really need to make this an, uh, an intermediate, which it is, so it's fine. All right, so they're learning again. Yep, Lu yep, Lupita and Kenna. Yep, they're learning again. That's, I guess it, yeah, I guess this is only good for Earth now. Hmm. The so Mary is, who's learning here? Farah, Isabel, and Lytle. Which is funny because they, are they actually learning how to cast Earth better? Huh. I don't actually know. Interesting, okay. So, I need an, actually an Earth Presser to be here, so we'll probably put Drake here, because Drake is our, no, yeah, Drake is our Earth Presser, so I'll put him there. And we'll say all students who want to learn there. But then I'm going to put... I'm gonna put 
Grand Staff here, and then he can teach nature to anyone who wants their nature. I just want to specialize the stone for it to be an Earth Professor. We at least want to do that. Um, we are not researching. It is currently wreck time. Uh, we need to look at getting a uh, sculpting station. Uh, we need to get that research done at some point. And now that we have uh, the items for this area, we can get a tanning rack, and that requires runewood and wormweed pods. So we can go and get that in here. And that's going to hurt our luxury, unfortunately. Now, how does this rug do? That's 16 luxury. Oh, and I'll be right back, guys. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I had to handle that real quick. And our uh, we're having to get our whole sink disposal removed, so having to deal with all that fun home ownership stuff. All right, so let's go and continue. I was working on getting the atelier set up, but that is, uh, we're missing some materials for that. We'll need to feed our bird, which means we're going to need to get the, um, we're going to have to get this research, which Jackson is working on. And then we'll have our, our lovely kitchen set up. So let's go ahead and get what we need for this setup. So let's take a look at the room, and it's going to be our workshop, and it's going to be our kitchen. And we need a small spice rack, a pantry, and then we need one or more chimney. It has to be lofted. So we have all of this other stuff working just fine. Let's go ahead and put a chimney on the side here. And this is going to be weird because you're technically going to walk out and there's going to be a chimney here. Uh, so we're going to have that chimney kind of like right, right there. Yeah, that'll look just fine. It'll smoke over of this little awning. It'll be fine. No one will notice the difference. We'll have some runners here I'm going through the kitchen. That'll look nice. And then uh, once we have that uh, research done, we'll set up that. And uh, yeah, looking good. Jackson's getting us done there. Having a lot going on about the school. We're gonna need to go down and do a lot of these tier two battles at some point to get more scrolls. Uh, but maybe once we get the script and we can start making our own scrolls and not worry about that as much. I don't feel like there's a lot to the underschool at the moment. I could be wrong and I haven't delved far enough down here. And let me know if that's the case. Um, but that could be what teleporters are used for later on as well, is that you can teleport around here and uh, get through the school really quickly. Uh, now, the thing is, is we don't have a professor that is... Well, we do have Rincewind, and Rincewind is supposed to handle our, um, our warding. But I don't think Rincewind has been doing his warding. So let's take a look at Rincewind and see what his jobs are at the moment. So Rincewind, his tasks are to most likely, yep, sleep. That's a candelabra, not Rincewind. <laughs> All right, so sleep, sleep on the floor. I don't understand why this is in here. Um, yeah, so there's no, there's no job set up for that. So can, is this a job I can set up tasks? Can we say like these are, ta like I feel like these should be task priority fives. I feel like those are super important. They should just be done. Okay, that's the rematch effigy. So we don't want to worry about that. So if I look at priority, and we look at Rincewind, and we're looking at Ward. So yeah, warding isn't his thing to do, so I don't know. Don't know what's going on there. But I'm going to skip through the night, and I will be back with you guys in a second. All right, guys, people are starting to wake up and do things. Uh, Lila was up really early. She was going and moving early in the morning. I don't know what she was doing, but... All right, so you are going to y'all's nice little... Professor quarters. I'm, I can't wait to have all this set up. Um, I could go ahead and get it kind of set up, but I, I, I kind of just want to have everything available to us. We really need to get that textile going. Um, I'm actually just going to say, hey, 20, because we're actually going to need a good bit of it. Um, so do until 20, and I need to use it. But we need to get the gruel pot going in order to make the slop. And then once this is done, uh, we'll have Jackson go and hopefully complete that, and that'll be good to go. Oh, man, getting y'all's wreck up. I think this is a good setup. And I just, I don't see any benefit to getting any more professors. We may need to get one more for, like, our darkness, but I don't know. I'm kind of, I feel like we're maxing out on our professors. And the only professor we don't have is an air one, um, which I think we'll be okay with. We, the airs are good for cleaning and stuff like that and assembling, but other than that, I don't feel like there's much need. All right, so let's go open our research here. And now that we have our cooking down, we can get whatever this is. So what does this do? So this, it's a refining beast for creating basic stone and metal regions. So it needs slop, it needs phoenix flowers, and it produces some other stuff. So we need to look at that at some point. Uh, we can make iron and sculpt. Oh, okay, we can make sculpt stone. 
Special stone for creating advanced magical objects. So we do need that. So let's go ahead and focus on getting that. And we really need to focus on getting some of this better food. Um, but we can at least make honeyed gruel. And so that'll be much better uh, for our professors and students. Um, so we need to make sure that our... Okay, so okay, you want to go get your rat. Good. Because we don't really have a great recipe for... Um, okay, when you make slop, let's make sure we make... I don't know, let's make five slop at the moment. Where's my cat doing something? I'm not sure what she's doing. Okay, can you can you not do that? Don't don't pull on the old internet cable. That would be terrible. Um Alright, so we have that going, we have our slop going, and now we have we're gonna we'll make bitter gruel as long as we can. Um we have tons of bitter rice, so let's just say, hey, let's make the honeyed gruel. Alright, I'm gonna be a little unfair. I'm gonna make honeyed gruel and I'm gonna make ten of it. And it just so we can go ahead and start using this. I'm going to utilize this chest. This, I'm going to copy its setting. So this is bitter gruel. So I'm going to actually move this. Oh, actually, wait a minute. This would be better to go up here. So this is this is the student's food. I, I, I hate the fact that I'm kind of doing this to them, but I feel like our professors have been... They've been sleeping in a place that is not really great, so we're going to make sure we have them in a... Uh, a better place to sleep and eat. So let's go ahead and do that. They've been dealing with enough. Let's put the eating chest right there. So that's where the honeyed gruel is going to go once it's cooked. Um, and let's make sure it is cooked. So we are making slop. Uh, we need to make sure the honeyed gruel is done. We have the bitter gruel. And we'll have that. Good. All right. So we have that stored there. That'll move there. Looking good. That hasn't been assembled yet. So we have that bitter rice. We can't make... The, um, we can't make the, uh, crow and, uh, the scarecrow until we have the meat. And to get the meat, we'll have to do some research on that. We have no research selected because that one's already done. Wow, that was quick. Um, I need to find the meat. Where's meat? Oh, yeah, so we need to get this. Um, so let's make sure we get enough arcane scrolls for that. And I may do some battles to do that. Uh, we'll go ahead and do that uh, so we can get uh, get those uh, extra resources. Uh, so we need to make sure we have. I want to see. I want to build one of these guys, and I don't know if it's worth putting this. Can we have this in here. Is that going to be too much? I really would love a refining beast room. We could put. I guess we could put a refining beast here. The students can take care of it. We could put a refining beast in this room. I guess. So the students can come down, and take care of it, and all that fun stuff. Uh, let's just put one right here for now. We don't have we have the slop, so we should be making resources now. Uh, we are out of wormweed. Uh, we do need to harvest that. So uh, you are working on that, which is good. What are you doing? Okay, it's rec time. I don't think I have enough job time. I think we're. Uh, let's take a look at our schedule again. Um, how, how is their recreation? Okay, so their recreation, if I take away their recreation, I don't think it'll, it's going to be too bad. I might have, well, we do have work in the middle of the day. I think separating things out has kind of, it makes them move kind of, well, I don't know. We'll, we'll leave it alone for right now. I may need to work on our schedule for right now. I think I'll leave it as it is. All right, making sure everyone's eating properly. We have our bitter gruel going here. We have our honey gruel going here. We have some incoming. Um, so the professors will eat that. Um, and I'm not gonna set, so all staff, all staff goes there. I'm not gonna set this for professors to eat until, um, until we have that ready. And now the problem is I'm going to go ahead and say, hey, don't use this. Um, we're going to shrink that table because we don't need it at the moment. The problem that I'm going to run into is, especially with our wolf kin, they need to eat certain things, I believe. And I don't think they eat... I don't think they eat, like, the honeyed gruel. Do not suffer conviction penalties if they sleep outside or on the floor, and they prefer to eat dire rat or crow over meals that have conviction penalties. Okay. Oh, okay, so over conviction penalties, which honey rule will not have a conviction penalty. Okay, great. 
So our cultist helpers will bring the honey to rule over. Um, I want to make sure that we are doing good on this. Uh, we have all of that. We don't, ooh, what we don't have though is honey drops. Honey drops need to go in here. So they're having to move all that around. So we need to make sure honey drops are going in there, which our quilted helper should actually be taking the honey drops and taking them back, I hope. Let's see, is you, you bringing honey drops? Oh, no, you're going up here. Oh, and there they go. Okay, there goes the, um, the refining beast. So as long as it has the ingredients, it'll make it, which the uh, these guys will help with. Uh, we are out of smoke sticks. We need to make sure we have these available to us. So we probably want to start looking at building those, but we don't have the ability to. So we're going to have to take what we have here and make sure we have those. So let's look at honey drops real quick. I do want to look over here, plant parts. We want to look at honey drop. Where are those located? They're in this chest. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, honey drops, no. Those are out and they go there. I noticed the hollow lily bloom. We needed those for something and I'm trying to remember what we needed to use those for. And you guys, yeah, you guys did mention, hey, these potions are actually really good for, uh, you know, um, <laughs> fighting uh, beasts and stuff like that. So we can actually make some of these. Um, we have tons of resources that we can actually use for these. I'm not gonna use potion of recharge, well, potion of recharging are useful. Uh, so we're gonna keep those. Ectoplasm, so we're revival class. We can say like, hey, do until we have, I don't know, four of them uh and then let's do four rejuvenations let's do until we have uh four of them as well so uh, we'll have our potion maker do that looking good uh we still are dragon room respawn monster soon oh dungeon i can't read oh i promise i can read just not very well all right so we have our level line what is the is this made? No, it's still assembling. Okay. What are we missing? Oh, we're just, uh, just someone to build it. All right, so class is going on. People are doing that. Uh, we have our research going. Uh, we did finish our spice things up. So is that just furniture? Did I miss that furniture? Yeah, here we go. So we have our sp small spice rack. So let's go ahead and put that. Uh, I want to put that guy kind of right. Let's put you right there we'll do a spice rack there so we have our chimney we have our spice rack um this is a luxury of 12 does it need to be anything else okay so we need 13 i'm hoping that other thing adds a luxury to it if not we'll add a candelabra to it what about a fine kitchen it needs to be lofted it needs two or more chimneys it needs 40 or greater luxury um so we can actually do this we just need to make sure that we have other other things oh, we need the large spice rack and the regular spice rack um, but this should uh, apply to be a kitchen, I hope. Does this uh, provide luxury? It does. All right, so that'll that'll actually give us our kitchen. Finally, we have our kitchen. Come on. No, focus on finishing this, please. <laughs> oh, you jerk. <laughs> All right, so do we have honey gruel in here now? We have one honey gruel. We need at least six in here for our professors. So... The problem is, is, I don't think I'm giving enough job time, maybe. Maybe that's it. And we need to focus on getting some more quilted helpers for other jobs, like cutting down trees and all that, so our professors aren't worrying about doing as much. And I guess this is where it's good for air. This isn't really construction, this is assembling, so like an air professor would be good here. It's not as needed, but, you know, it's something. All right, kitchen, look at that. We finally have a kitchen, and that way we can cook better. Very good. All right, so we're finally, finally filling out rooms. Oh, it feels so good. All right, so we can actually, once we get the Scrivenry desk, we can actually focus on getting this done. Um, we're still missing some ash parchment and smoke sticks, so we're still working on that. And we probably won't have smoke sticks until we uh, finish making the ash parchment. So we really need to have this. We need the wood cuttery, because I think the wood cuttery... No, that's just winding tree growing, right? I wish there was something for plant growing, right? Because these technically aren't trees, which kind of sucks, but I'm sure they'll add that down the road. All right, and for the woodcutter, we don't have a lot of trees in there, do we? Uh, garden. Uh, bristle cones. Let's put some bristle cones in here. Uh, we'll have... Uh, let's see, we'll do... Yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll have a bristle cone tree here as well. There we go. All right. 
I know we can replace those with rune wood, but we're still a ways off for that, so we're not going to worry about that at the moment. Okay, so have we finished all of our other research? We really need to focus on getting a medical center. That would help a lot. Uh, I feel like for cooking, we need to focus on that. Uh, getting these extra helpers would not be bad. That'll repair. That would be very good. Uh, mining would be very decent. A wandering mage's grave. A place to bury a corpse will spawn a spirit that will scout the fog and bring back smoke pearls. Oh, that's kind of cool. Dark arts. Teach us dark arts. And then a kindly mage's grave. And that will... Your staff... Uh, cast will make one of your staff heartened and hallow lily bloom. Okay, so that's where we get our hallow lily at. Uh, and then there's our tier three dark specialization. And that'll give us a wise mage's grave. Inspired. Okay. And then we have eye glob globe. Places on floors in the ground. Okay, cool. Uh, what else can we get? We can get some potions. Let's go ahead and grab those. Throw me. Focus on those at the moment. So we still need a lot of. Uh, we need a lot of luxury here. We have 19 because we had to put this in here, so we have to make up a good bit of that. Which I don't, unfortunately, think this is going to be enough. It's going to provide 16, and we need a lot of fibrous textile. Uh, which means we need our bird to do a lot of work over here. And he is out of ingredients for that, and that is wormweed pods. So we need a lot more of that. Uh, we need to harvest it. I like how all you guys are harvesting this one wormweed pod. Can our... Yeah, okay, they can move through there. Okay, so they can move through single spaces. I am going to harvest anything that we see here. Uh, oh my rats! All right, let's hunt those ten rats. Let's hunt. Uh, let's harvest these. We have a lot of phoenix kisses, so we'll harvest those. Um, there's a croa corpse here. I'm just gonna destroy that because we don't use corpses fast enough right now. And then also I'm gonna hunt you because they're destroying Felicity's grave, which is not great. This is Felicity, right? Yeah. Betsy's in my other game. Uh, let's see here. We have the smoke spore caps, and then ooh, look at that guy. Oh, yeah. Huh. Very good. All right. So we have finally have our kitchen. We finally have a good conservatory. We finally have a good dining room. We finally... I mean, it's, it feels really good to finally get rooms going. Um, I'm actually going to, like, take a picture of this guy because we finally got an advanced classroom, and I feel like that's... I don't know. That's that's an achievement for us, right? I also need a thumbnail, so... Yeah, there's also that. All righty. So we have... Char Charshal Charshalit Charshal Char Oh, you know what? That yes. Uh, stone, iron, and sculptstone. Let's focus on sculptstone. What does that need? That just needs wood. Really? Okay, cool. Uh, do until we have. I don't know. Can I type a number? No. Control. Sh oh, they added. Okay, this is another thing. So you hit control. You hit ten. So let's do uh, until you have thirty sculptstone. So that'll make our that'll be use of our wood as well. So we'll make some sculpt stone there. Um, have the refining <laughs> refining beasts out here. Um, I hate the fact that they're just kind of hanging out here, but, you know. What can you do? Okay, we can still double-click and do that. If we want to select a bunch of stuff there. Is that Croa? I don't know. I think I might just leave them alone at, the po at this point. We really need to get the scare Croa. And they disrespected me by put a Croa in us right next to my bitter rice. All right, so we're out of ingredients for slop. We're out of wormweed pods. I'm noticing we need a lot of wormweed. I might need to put another guard because I don't think two wormweed plants are going to be enough for us here. Grown 100%. That's marked for harvest. Yeah, we don't have enough harvesting. Also, our chrome bug is ready to hatch. So let's hatch our chrome bug. All right. We need. Is the boat going to do this? Requires earth four. Oh, you can. Wow. And then we need water three and nature three. Okay. That works for us. All right. So now what this means is we can, I think this is how I'm going to end this episode is I'm going to make this dang wood cuttery that we've been trying to make for several episodes. If I have the ingredients to make this stuff I need here. So for the large window, let's, let's just look here. I don't want to get my hopes up. We need 10 frost glass. That's all we need. And the wood cuttery, I'm going to make sure I'm not getting my hopes up here. The woodcuttery, I'm gonna let them do that. I'm gonna slow it on time. All right, so we have our Chromebug. Look at that guy. Um, 
Mm, excuse me. Oh, man, I hope that didn't come through the mic. I, I don't know if I, I think I said this in this episode, but man, if if I'm if I go quiet or I, I just I, indigestion, man, it sucks. All right, so workshop. A woodcuttery, woodcuttery. So we need it to be grounded, two or more trees, one or more wand shaper, and one or, wait, does that say huge? Okay, we just need frost glass, all right. You, hi, buddy. We need some frost glass, can you do that for us? We need 10 of it. So do until X, so let's do 10, so let's control click, and we'll do 10 frost glass. All right. I want these guys to be four if they can handle them. Uh, we want to make sure our beasts are taken care of, so if the students can, they will take care of them. So, let's see here. We need at least ten of that, and it needs to be taken care of, so it needs affection. So our students should come over here and take care of our Chromebug. Okay, and its name is Lump- oh, is it? No. Crick Humbler. Crumbler. Crick Humbler. Chromebug. That is an interesting name for that. Uh, do they- oh wait, are those their names, or what they're just called? Rope Hawk, Weaver Bird. Okay, so that's a Weaver Bird in Chromebug, so his name is Prick Crumbler. Interesting. Interesting name. So, okay, he needs taken care of. All right, all right, all right. So is he, does he make one for every time he's taken care of? Is that it? Brother, are you okay? What? What is? What is going on here? It still needs affection? It still needs a lot of affection. So it gets a 50% refining time mod. Oh, okay, so it just needs a lot of affection and feeding. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna slow this down for a second. I'm actually gonna pause, because um I like how the pig is just stuffing its face in lava. Okay. I'm gonna take a little bit of a screenshot there because I don't know. I feel like I feel like that could make a good thumbnail too. Of course, that frost glass needs to move. Someone can pick this up. I need a quilted beast. There you go. Come here and get that guy. Yeah. So maybe we need multiples of this, of these. Maybe I should get two of them. But he's getting to work again. So it's just as long as we feed him what he needs, he'll refine it. So we need ten frost glass for that. So I guess we'll let them refine. I almost feel like I need two of them. But I know there's not gonna be another one that fits here, unfortunately. Okay, he's made sculpt stone, which is good. Oh, but he makes a mess, so these guys have to clean it up. Okay. Well, okay, that, 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 that's useful for our uh, quilted helpers on cleaning. Okay, once we have that frost glass going. Okay, so we're quieting that. And this might be where I should put some wood. Because we're having to bring wood all the way over here for this guy. So we can put like resources here for wood. And I don't know if we, cause we have so much wood that we may be able to store multiple places of wood. So I can say like storage. We need like a tiny chest with wood in it. We'll get a tiny chest and we'll say, hey, wood goes there. We don't really need, oh, this guy can make sculpt them too, an ignium. Okay, so our boar makes sculpt stone and you make sculpt stone. I'm gonna say wood goes here. Okay, what are you guys doing? Okay, you guys are taking care of that. Uh, okay, so we're taking care of you. The chrome bug is, okay, so this is slowly go up. It does, okay, so now it's at a 200% modifier. That's even better, okay, wow. So, okay, everyone's feeling good. Our beasts are feeling good. All right, let's go ahead and let's clear all, and what's gonna go in here is just wood. We're gonna put wood here. Okay. All right, so they're bringing wood over here. Um, from that going, we have smoke stick and wormweed. Uh, how is your refining going? You have ten our ash parchment now, which means I think we can make our desk. No, we need fifteen. Okay, we're getting there. Uh, we still need plenty of smoke stick, which we do not have. Unfortunately, we need to make sure we have harvest jobs for these. Um, I see that our the crowas are absolutely decimating our bitter rice plots per usual. We'll get that crow nest at some point, or a crow a scarecrow at some point. It'll happen. Just not a win. All right, huge window. Where are we at? Furniture, lighting, huge window. We need 
couple more. Okay, we have eight now, or seven. Yeah, he crafts really fast now. I know I know, I have it on fast forward, but that is uh, really quick still. Uh, drink as much as you can, pour it on out. So we can have the water teaching fountain after this, but that's 24. I think we've maxed out all of our research. We really need scrolls, which means we need that desk. Oh, but we can go get this. We can get the bell tower, and we can get stained glass windows, and a suit of armor. Oh, man, cool. Uh, we can get the whole lot of support uh, if we really want. Um, we really need to get this because that'll let us get fancy beds, even though we even have the canopy beds. I don't really think we need the fancy beds at this point. Uh, we need to liven the place up. That'll help us get luxury. Uh, we have a lot we can go for. I'm going to go with this because that's the only thing we can get at the moment. All right, very good. Uh, it is currently nighttime. Our bug is refining as much as he can. We have nine. We need one more. Okay, our quilted beasts are getting to work. And I honestly am thinking about getting more quilted beasts. There's very rarely a time where they're not doing something. All right, so we have 10 frost glass. He doesn't have any jobs available to him. So we can get this absolutely massive window that's going to go right there. It can't be reached. Of course it can't. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and cancel that and let's do this again. Let's get a huge window. We'll lower that by one. And they should reach that. And then what I could actually, you know what? Hang on. Move you. I don't know where yet, but I want you to move. Uh, where can we put another window? What would be a good place for a window? Uh, this isn't really lit up here, so we can put it here. That'll help a little bit. And then we can put this huge window. We cancel that. And then once that window moves, we can have um, we can have a huge window behind the wand shaper. Now I'll probably put it like right there, maybe, and then have it there instead. Okay, once people wake up, we will get that going. Uh, they were dancing, so uh, once they're done with their recreation, uh, there'll be classroom time, and anyone who's not teaching will go do other jobs. But we have idle staff. Who's idling? Felicity is idling. Felicity hasn't been doing much, hasn't she? Are you stuck, Felicity? Oh! We trapped Felicity. Let's see, you can move that and get out of there. There you go. Wow, I cannot. She somehow got trapped there. That's unfortunate. <laughs> uh, cancel enlarge. Uh, so we can probably put this guy back here and hopefully Felicity. Doesn't... I was like, why is Felicity not doing anything? And I really, oh, she's trapped. Yeah, that'll, that's bad. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, build a copy and hopefully someone won't get stuck here again. The spiral staircase is a little strange here, but I think it works. I think. What was that? Minor school fog were depleted, so that means that the fog is back. All right, cool. We will handle that at some point. I have a more pressing concern right now, and that is getting this window in. So we're going to put this giant window in here. And please build this. I want this to be a priority number five. This needs to be done immediately. I don't know who needs to do it or who, whichever, but it needs to get done. Uh, and our Earth professor who constructs is busy doing other things at the moment. Sigh. All right, so now that we have all of our beasts hatched, I need to consider whether or not we want any more or if we're fine with the amount of beasts we have right now. Uh, but we do have the textile and stuff being made. Really, it's just we're out of wormweed and stuff like that. Uh, so we need to make sure that we have more wormweed going around, which means I may need to put more um, things in this room in order for us to do that. And honestly, hey, what I see here is a perfect opportunity to put another wormweed planter. So we're going to put that there. <laughs> All right, so we now have this main lane, I guess we could say, for um, uh, our professors to go down and uh, for this massive maze of a garden. Uh, is our Earth Professor busy? Uh, uh, what, what is our Earth Professor doing? Interesting, I don't know what they're doing. All right, come on, I wanna see this complete. We've been waiting so long for this. This might be the thumbnail. I've been I've been waiting for this for several episodes at this point. Okay, what's wrong with it? All right, why is this not working? It's grounded. It has 18 luxury. What's what's wrong? Woodcuttery. One or more, two or more trees must have one. Three or more large window. Uh, oh wait, must have one. One or more large, huge window. 
must not have any refining beasts. Okay, that's where we're, okay. So let's move our, let's move these guys. We'll move them up here with our bird, since that's what we're doing here. I have no idea which way they're gonna be facing, but it's fine. Let's go ahead and move them. Sorry guys, you gotta move, which means your chest has to move too. Uh, we want this refining beast, so let's go ahead and move you. All right, so we have our two refining beasts here. I have no idea which way is facing the right way, but that will make it work. And that means we're gonna need to move their resource chest as well. Uh, chest, we need to move you. So this is gonna go up here. And honestly, we may be able to put something for the bird up here as well. I think this will work just fine. There it is, the wood cuttery. It's finally done. It's finally done. We finally completed this stupid room. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay, so now our trees. So let's see, wood cuttery. So let's take a look at this. 50% wand crafting rate and 100% tree growth rate. So our trees will grow even faster, which means rune wood will grow faster. I kind of hope we either get a greenhouse or something for these plants. And so that way we can just have, you know, I don't know, just something for our plants to get a bonus too, because I want our plants to be able to be harvested too. Uh, one thing I would love to see before I decide to call this episode is when we have quilted helpers. Okay, who's idle? Who's stuck? Again, again. Okay, we're not. You know, we're just gonna shrink that and not worry about it. All right. So one thing I do want to check is that are we gonna have a quilted helper that can harvest? I don't think so. No, we won't. Okay, that's fine. Well, actually, hang on, wait. Handyman, nice repair. Okay, cool. Well, guys, that is gonna be end for this episode. I do apologize for skipping out on some of the other content that I had recorded, but it, unfortunately, that just happens. Um, but I hope you guys are enjoying this series as always. Any feedback is always greatly appreciated. Liking, commenting, etc., etc. You guys know the drill. I got, hope you guys have a wonderful day wherever you may be. And as always, thank you for spending some of your time here. And I hope to see you for the next video. Bye, everybody.